Cases of vandalism plaguing the nation's schools remain a serious concern for the Ministry of Education. Therefore, in outlining plans to rehabilitate six schools under the Grenada Educational Enhancement Project, Chief Education Officer Elvis Moreen says a major component of the project is training in school maintenance. Um, we are seeing that many of our school facilities, they are not kept, they are not maintained, but some of them are actually deliberate attempts to vandalize the, the, um, the facility, and we have a difficulty with this. So the ministry would make a concerted effort to address this issue and uh, to train as well as keep you know, things in train to ensure that our school infrastructure is addressed. Because um, as many of you know, um, we are still struggling with some issues, school infrastructure from post-Ivan. Meanwhile, six secondary schools have been earmarked for rehabilitation. 15 million U.S. dollars have been approved by the Caribbean Development Bank to undertake such a project. Chief Education Officer Elvis Moraine says the four schools will receive urgent attention in the interim. As it relates to um, where we are now, we would have um, earmarked some four of the projects, the schools too, and we have to work on them simultaneously because of the time. So the Grenada Seventh-day Adventist Comprehensive School, Bishop's College, Presentation Brothers College, and St. Joseph's Convent St. George's, there is a retaining wall there that we need to address, you know, in the interim. Timing is everything for government, even as they seek to expedite the waiting process before the start of the construction at Bishop's College. As we speak, we are finalizing the technical work to have work commence. We would have received, um, I think, three of the no objections from CDB, so we are waiting the final one. We are looking at the possibility to expedite the process of single sourcing these projects. Um, because, as you know, timing is important. And uh, sometimes, if you have to go through the process of trying to, the, the, the tendering, the way it's supposed to be done, we sometimes can lose a lot of time on the project. So really, we are hoping Bishops is of great interest for us. And um, so far, the government will invest um, a huge sum there in the relocation efforts. Under the GEEP program, three schools, including one primary and two secondary schools, will receive new facilities. They are the Battered St. Andrews Anglican Primary School, Grenada Christian Academy, and the St. David's Catholic Secondary School. Government has not released the date of commencement for the rehabilitation works. Amondel Sampson, GBN News.